Like and subscribe now, or you're gonna have bad luck. As one of the most oldest working animals, hundreds of different horse breeds have been bred over the years. Horses were used for centuries to transport goods, plow fields, and as the main mode of transportation. However, horses quickly got replaced when the internal revolution kicked off in the United Kingdom and the United States. Since then, several horse breeds have become critically endangered. In this video, we are going to look at the top 10 most unusual and rare horse breeds. Let's begin. Number 10. The Caspian Although Caspian is a small horse, it is not considered a pony. The lean and athletic Caspian is believed to be the oldest horse breed in the world and traces its history all the way back to 3000 BCE in Iran. The Caspian was used by royalty and artifacts from this time period depict the Caspian including the trilingual seal of King Darius the Great. The staircase frees it at the palace of Persopolis and the gold ox's treasure of Durabgird. For many years, it was thought that these ancient Persian horses had died out, but it is now strongly believed that the modern Caspian is the direct descendant of these ancient horses. Currently, Caspians are being bred outside of their native Iran, which has undergone political upheaval over the last several years. It is estimated that there are fewer than 2,000 Caspians left in the world today. Number 9. Akultiki Widely believed to be one of the oldest surviving and purest horse breeds, the Akultiki is a descendant of the ancient Turkmen horse that originated from Asia and was used by nomadic tribes as a war horse. The Akultiki horse is considered to be one of the most beautiful horse breeds in the world due to its metallic-like shine to its fur, giving this breed the appearance of golden and bronze statues almost. In Turkmenistan, this breed is the national horse breed, and they are even known as the Golden Horse. This breed developed in response to the decertification of Central Asia and was used by nomadic tribes to travel long distances. While this is already a fairly rare breed, the population of these horses is threatened due to factors such as inbreeding within the population. Number 8. Falabella. The Falabella is a small Argentine horse that rarely stands above 32 inches in height. It is one of the smallest horse breeds in existence. The Falabella is not considered a pony, but rather a miniature horse due to its bloodline. The breed is healthy for its size, and almost and most Falabellas can be ridden by small children and pull small carts. Falabellas are hardy, intelligent, docile, and trainable, with balanced conformation and a refined appearance. Their legs are strong, and their body is slim yet compact. Falabellas can be many different colors, including pinto and leopard spotted, although black and brown are the most common. It's estimated that there are a few thousand purebred Falabellas scattered across the world. They are used for various purposes, including mounts for small children, therapy horses, guide animals for the vision impaired, and showing in hand and under harness. They are just as content being companion animals as they are in the show ring. Number 7. Bashkir Curly Horse Also known as the American Bashkir Curly, the Curly is a breed of horse that comes in all sizes, colors, and body types. Despite all these differences, they all carry the gene for a unique curly coat of hair. The unique gene that gives curlies their curly hair can be expressed minimally, maximally, extremely, or any variation in between. The summer coat shows a slight wave in it, but not as extreme as the winter curls. Curlies are known for their calm, intelligent, and friendly personalities. They are highly trainable and personable and love being around people. They are also claimed to be the only hypoallergenic breed of horse. Research indicates a protein is missing from their hair of a curly, which may be what causes allergic reactions to horses and allergy sufferers. The curly has a characteristically long stride and bold movement. They have tough hooves, strong bones, and exceptional endurance. Most curlies range from miniature horses to draft horses. Number 6. Dale's Pony Like most of the horses, the Dale's Pony is from England. The Dale's Pony is one of the country's native mountain and moorland pony breeds. Historically, Dale's Ponies were used in the lead mining industry. The Dale's Pony came about after the largest, strongest, and most active Scottish Galloways were bred with native herds to produce the best horses for working in lead mining. In the 18th century, Dale's ponies were used to pull stagecoaches and deliver mail because of their speed and agility. 
During both world wars, Dale's ponies were drafted into the British Army to carry weapons. Over the years, the population of Dale's ponies has declined because they are no longer needed to work in various industries. The global population of Dale's ponies is estimated to be about 800. Number 5. Soraya the Soraya is an ancient breed of horse native to South Iberia. They are thought to be the last remnant population of the indigenous wild horses that roamed southern Iberia. Paleolithic art images depict equines with a distinct likeness to the Soraya and similar zebra-like markings. Studies are currently being undertaken to discover the relationship between the Soraya and various other wild horse breeds, including the recently extinct Tarpon and other breeds stemming from the Iberian Peninsula and Northern Africa. The Soraya horse is small but hardy and well adapted to the often harsh conditions in which it evolved. Sorayas are known as easy keepers, thriving on very little feed and needing little human intervention to remain healthy. They have an independent nature, but once bonded with their rider, they are loyal, willing, and versatile mounts. Sarayas are usually dun or a dun variation called grullo. Primitive markings are common including the black dorsal stripe, black tipped ears, horizontal striping on the legs, and a dark muzzle. Soraya horses have bicolored manes and tails with lighter colored hair fringing both sides of the longer grown black hair. Sarayas are very rare and there are less than 200 left in the world today. Number 4. The Gypsy Vanner The Gypsy Vanner horse is a beautiful breed envisioned by the Gypsies of Great Britain. The horse was selectively bred for over half a century from a vision to create the perfect horse to pull the Gypsy Caravan. The Gypsy Vanner is often referred to as a people-sized draft horse. The breed's genetic origins include the Shire, the Clydesdale, and the native British ponies such as the Dales. The Gypsy Vanner is not a color breed. It is a body type with heavy bone and broad body like a draft. The first characteristic often noticed is the abundance of feathers flowing from behind the knee and hocks and the long free flowing mane and tail. In addition to impressive looks, the Gypsy Vanner possesses a temperament that is friendly and engaging. Originally bred to pull the Gypsy Wagon, these horses are now being used in all disciplines. You will see them pulling carts and carriages, riding in the dressage ring, as well as over fences as western pleasure horses. The Gypsy Vanner is a beautiful family horse and is famous for a trail or therapy horse due to its calm nature. Number 3. The Norwegian Fjord Horse The Norwegian Fjord Horse is a relatively small but powerful horse breed from western Norway's mountainous regions. Norway's oldest horse breed has been used for hundreds of years as a farm horse in Norway. In modern times, it is famous for its generally good temperament. It is used both as a harness horse and under saddle. Its unequal dependability distinguishes the fjord horse. For centuries, Norwegian breeders have been determined to improve the breed while emphasizing the calm and gentle temperament. They are easily broken and need no retraining even after spending months at pasture untouched. The fjord's strength, clean lines, and exceptionally adaptable nature have made them equally well suited to harness or saddle. They can be ridden English or Western, hunted or driven in shows, parades, and down country roads. Their mild manner makes them an ideal family horse, ridden or driven easily by the novice or youngster as well as a knowledgeable adult horseman. Number two, the black forest horse. Criticized by a, characterized by a dense golden mane that pops against the rich chestnut color of their coat, the Black Forest Horse is an endangered German breed of light draft horse from the Black Forest of Southern Germany. The Black Forest Horse is a draft horse of light to medium weight. It is known for its great temperament and beautiful movement, which differentiates it from other draft breeds. Its long strides and elegant trot make it ideal not only for driving but also for riding. This breed tends to be agreeable and well-tempered, so it's well-suited for many different drives and riders. The Black Forest Horse is an endangered breed. In 2017, it was recorded that there was a population of 88 stallions and 1,077 mares. 
On the bright side, these horses are believed to have a high fertility rate, and through careful breeding, there are hopes to see those numbers increase soon. Many individuals are dedicated to growing the breed's numbers, so they will never become a thing of the past. Number 1. The Camarouge Horse The Camarouge Horse is an ancient breed of horse indigenous to the Camarouge area in southern France. It is generally considered one of the oldest breeds of horses in the world. For centuries, possibly thousands of years, these small horses have lived wild in the harsh environment of the Camarouge marshes and wetlands of the Rhone Delta. The Camarouge horse is the traditional mount of the guardians, the Camarouge cowboys, who herd the black Camarouge bulls used for course Camarouge in southern France. Camarouge horses galloping through water is a popular and romantic image of the region. They are small horses generally standing 135 to 150 centimeters at the withers and weighing between 350 and 500 kilograms. Despite their small size, they have the strength to carry grown adults. They are considered rugged and intelligent. The Camarouge horse has long legs, which are well proportioned, strong and resistant, with big knees and hocks. Their hooves are very hard and tough, with large and wide soles suited for their original marshy habitat. Their calm temperament, agility, intelligence, and stamina have resulted in these horses being used for equestrian games, dressage, and long distance riding, growing in popularity in France. Which one of these horses did you find the most fascinating? Let us know in the comments, and if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.